When you're Tom Hanks, you can get away with anything, anything. Let me give you an example. The other day, I'm at the supermarket, and this woman comes running up to me. She's got her four-year-old son in tow, and he's holding a bunch of balloons, right? So she goes, Mr. Hanks, I just love your movies. I loved you in Cast Away and Forrest Gump, which, let's just be honest, is a dumb piece of shit movie. But anyway, she's going on and on, sucking my dick, and then she says, Mr. Hanks, could you watch my son for a moment? I need to go to the bathroom. So, of course, I oblige. And I'm looking at this kid, so happy, so content, not a care in the world, right? So I look him dead in the eye. I say, hey, kid, you like those balloons? And then I just start popping them, one by one, popping them, really taking my time. And he starts crying and shit, but I just keep doing it. So his mom comes back and she's like, oh my God, what happened? And I said, you're a piece of shit son. He just popped all his balloons. And she believed me because I'm Tom Hanks. You know what I did the other day? A line of coke off a hooker's ass. Yeah. And then I strangled her for no reason. No reason at all. Just cold-blooded murder. I don't even know why. Maybe just to see if I could get away with it, I guess. So then later, I'm dumping the body in a sewer. True story. And these 20-somethings come running up. Now, this hooker, she's halfway sticking out the sewer. A pair of legs and fishnet stockings and stilettos just shooting out the manhole. And they didn't even notice. It was like she didn't exist. So I signed their autographs, finished disposing of the body, then carried on like it was any other Tuesday. I'm telling you, when you're Tom Hanks, you can do anything.